A new phase in politics has won the Brown County executive race. Troy Streckenbach was elected by a 58 to 41 percent margin. The small business owner beat out Brown County Supervisor Andy Nicholson. Fox 11's Ben Krumholtz has more. Well, we knew there'd be a new Brown County executive after Tom Hins announced his retirement last November. And now it appears his replacement will be Troy Streckenbach beating out Andy Nicholson. The county executive's duties include managing the budget and overseeing department heads. But Streckenbach says getting more jobs to the area will be a major priority for him. Brown County needs to be a leader and also get out there and to attract those businesses. Gathering at Pauly G's in Green Bay, Nicholson maintained the executive's focus should be managing the county budget and not attracting jobs to the area. That's not the, the, the job of the county executive unless you're going to promote uh, government jobs. Streckenbach received the support of incumbent Hins, who was at the St. Brendan's Victory Party. Streckenbach entered the race without any political experience and says the Hins endorsement was beneficial. I was running on a campaign of freezing our property taxes, reducing our general debt, and ensuring that we have 4,000 jobs. Um, and I was running on fiscal, cons uh, fiscal responsibility and also on accountability. As for Nicholson, he Enormous hopes to work spending. with Streckenbach to and further the interests of Brown County taxpayers. We will work together. We have some uh, major deficits, and I'll work with the county executive and the county board like I have been in the last nine years, and we'll get through these uh, problems. Among Streckenbach's first tasks will be eliminating an expected 35 Half to $4 million budget shortfall for Brown County. He'll serve a four-year term, being paid $89,000 a year. Reporting in Green Bay, Ben Crumholz, Fox 11 News.